220, I'm going to be doing an overview of the Sultan Republic deck from Illusionist. If you want this deck of cards, you can get it at illusionist.com. That's with an E. So it's in the description. I'll leave a link for it. Um, I do these giveaways. Every time I gain a thousand subscribers on this channel, I give away decks of cards and I ask you guys to leave a comment leaving different decks of cards. And this is one that actually got added to the mix. Uh, and this is my favorite deck that you guys have uh, requested, more so than the David Blaine Split Spades deck. Uh, it is just beautiful finish, it's silver, it's extremely detailed, and uh, everything is like embossed on uh, this deck, on this box at least. You can, uh, it has a texture to it, it is just a, a gorgeous, gorgeous deck of cards, and I love that the sticker is like Sultan Republic SR. You know, so those those little details go a long way. And uh, so I'm going to be doing an overview of this deck of cards. If there's anything that I don't say about this deck of cards, please leave a comment so the other viewers can uh, see what this deck is about because you guys know more than uh, collecting cards than I do. I'm heavy on just all the cards being different, not just one. So here's the two jokers. Ace of Spades is cool. I love that it's not your typical bicycle uh, font. It's it's very different. It's very narrow. And uh, but here's one of my favorite things about these cards is every every card has this different design, you know. And that's that's really cool. I I like being able to get a deck of cards where all the cards feel unique and not like just one card is modified or th just the jokers are different like that doesn't I don't really care for that so all these it's just something so simple that they did every spade has this kind of different design to it too and you'll notice that too when we get to like the, the diamonds and the, the other different cards it's just yeah this one's uh, very similar but look at that that is so interesting it's something so simple that they did, but it's beautiful, and so on opposite ends. So on the left, on the right, but it's still mirrored either way. And this is cool too, when you get here, the middle one, the middle pip, is a solid color. And this is definitely not your rich red that we're used to for bicycles, but uh, that's another part that makes it that much more unique. So every card is like that with the centerpiece. If it's even, like the sixes, all of these are gonna be like that. But the seven of diamonds, because it has that middle one, it has that solid color. And that is uh, just something very interesting. And again, with these narrow edges here, very cool. It's got these gray in here. They definitely went the extra mile to make these uh, something a little different. Again, the middle is this, this solid black club. So this is another uh, yeah this is the my favorite deck that you guys uh, have requested this deck came with a double back card that's cool that they included that here's a closer up look of the joker joker is like this instead of your typical across the face here's the actual design it's got a crown some mountains and a snowflake if uh, if you guys know the reason for why they may have done that leave a comment and uh, it'll be it'll just be cool to learn different things about these cards that uh, you guys naturally would have a better grasp than I would. You guys are smarter than I am when it comes to collecting cards. And here's the Ace of Spades, Sultan Republic, and uh, it's made up of all leaves. That's really cool. A leaf here, a leaf there, a little branched out. I feel like I'm learning different things about these decks as the days go on, so if you know why they chose to use the leaves and create that look, is this supposed to look like two different things or you know what I mean? A double entendre of sorts, but in design. And here's the back design. Same kind of thing going with the Joker. We got the leaves, the two arrows, snowflake, and the mountains. I'm looking for where the crown might be. Um, but it's got the it's got spade logos there. It's got leaves throughout these arches, diamonds. Beautiful, beautiful back design. Whoever designed this did a hell of a job. It's almost got like a bluish hue to it too. It's not it's not super pure black. This deck is very cool. There's how it is with a fan, one-handed fan. Looks beautiful that way. I'm sure it handles well when it comes to feels good to me. 
feels like a strong deck of cards for sure. Again, this deck is now in the mix with all of my giveaways where I give away free decks of cards and I'll even sign them if you wish every time I gain a thousand subscribers. So this is now in the mix for all my giveaways, every future giveaway. So thank you for subscribing, be inspired to learn, aspire to disturb, and always rise above.